Seth and I met at Swarthmore. Our wedding was like a Swarthmore reunion. I came into Swarthmore a nerd, but I also came in as an introvert. Didn't really know who I was in a lot of ways. As a kid, I wanted to be an inventor. But as I got older, I really wanted to have more of a direct impact on improving people's lives. My day job is at the Mayo Clinic College of Medicine and Science. I work there to facilitate a pipeline of underrepresented students into medical school, into our School of Health Sciences. The Division of Engineering serves the entire clinic. We create a collaboration with these researchers to push the science forward, push the technology forward to improve healthcare. We wanted to get involved with community. I started volunteering with the Boys and Girls Club. That would essentially be kind of like a lake. Thank you for joining us today on Our Town. I have always been in search of community. When I find it, I commit really hard to it. The great part is being able to shape the content and being able to tell those stories. Depending on the day, sometimes I have a lot of community meetings. Support or help the work of each of the other folks. And then rush to go pick up Zoe to bring her home and get dinner ready. It's this paradox where it's, it's super exhausting, but at the same time, like, I wouldn't have it any other way. My time at Swarthmore really gave me certain frameworks to understand issues in a unique way that I think is really critical. It's super satisfying that the work that I'm doing is directly impacting how healthcare is going to be delivered in the next 20, 30 years. Swarthmore launched me into a way of being that I had only imagined before I had started college.